ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಚಾಕಲ್ಪತರುವಶ್ಯಕೆ ಪಾಸಿಂದುಭವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೇಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಕಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಘಯತ್ ಗಿರಿ ಜಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವಿತೂಷಿ ದೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಚ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ್ಯ ನರಂಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿಂ ಸರಸ್ವತಿಂ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋಗರ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭಿರಿಂಚನು ತರಣ್ಯ ಭೇತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪುನತಪಾಲ್ಯಭವಾದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನೀಕ್ಷಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಂಪಿ ಗಪವಧೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗ್ರಸಸಾಗ್ರ ಸಾರುಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕೃಪಾಂಕೋಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶಿಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶಿಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾ ಬುಧಾತು ಶಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕರು ಕಮಲಾಶತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲು ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾವತಾರೋ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋದಿಬ್ಬರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ ಬಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣೋ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ಬಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ಯಭದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀತ್ ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
श्री चैतन्य पदाभुज मधुपेभ्यो नमो नम कथंचित आश्रया जेसम सा ओपी तद्कंद भाग भावि श्री चैतन्य पदाभुज मधुपेभ्यो नमो नम कथंचित आश्रया जेसम सा ओपी से तद्गंध भाग भावि गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी डॉक्टर प्रभुपात परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट बॉन्डेड सोल कैन रिजर्व द राइट ऑफ फॉल डाउन एनी टाइम गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी डॉक्टर प्रभुपात परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट Bonded soul can reserve the right of fall down any time. So we have no reason to criticize others. When I myself can fall down, there is no surety. Then how I can criticize others? I have no right to criticize others. But pure Guru Vishnu, they are acting as Guru Acharya. If they are going to chide me, give me punishment, criticize me, then they cannot fall down. Papa speaking, Guru Vishnu. Sometimes they are bound to criticize me, chide me, beat me. That doesn't mean my Guru Padma can fall down because he is going to criticize me. So Papa speaking, sometimes. pure guru vishnu is going to speak heavily against somebody criticizing they are bound to criticize to rectify them so there is no question of their fall down don't think my gurudev can fall down out of their tremendous affection they like to rectify me that's why they are criticizing they are not criticizing like bonded soul one bonded soul criticizing others not that they are not going to get reaction for that criticism par in chaitanya chaitanya it is written kahare na kare ninda krishna krishna bole ajo chaitanya charan jinibik hele those who are not going to criticize others only those who are busy with hari naam sankirtan and guru vishnu bhagavat seva they can very easily climb the lotus feet of goranga mahaprabhu they can climb no problem so prabhupad used to say we have no reason to criticize others because bonded soul can reserve the right to fall down any time no surety bonded soul means full of anartha bonded soul mean full of anartha bonded soul mean full of anartha bonded soul can erase 80% anartha but still is bonded soul 80% anartha gone 20% there but still is bonded soul 90% gone seal bonded soul 99% gone 1% none of there still bonded soul but elevated is condition is high condition no problem bonded soul sometime expressing doubt about what we can get after doing so many after doing so much as astrities and penances and bhajan what the target we can get there is no surety they are expressing doubt sometime why they are expressing doubt because till today their bonded condition is there maybe 60% gone some bonded condition bishnu chakud was speaking we are going to lose our patience we cannot keep patience we cannot believe guru vishnu 100% we 
we cannot keep patience. We are going to lose patience. Oh, what I can do? Life is going. I am not getting any result of bhajan. Vishwamitra Kudu was speaking foolish. You don't know. You cannot see how much percentage bonded condition is there inside you. That's why you are going to express this kind of mood. You have no idea. Up to now, how much, how much percentage already gone? Anartha, you have no idea. That's why you are going to lose your patience. Vishwanath Chakravarti was speaking, suppose somebody going to put you in chain bondage. Suppose somebody going to put you in, put, somebody going to put you in chain bondage. By chance, one very nice, you know, man is going to discover you alone, you are in bonded condition. He is going to get one hacksaw blade, hacksawman, iron cutter blade, and going to cut very carefully. He is going to cut. Almost 98% Still, the pain is same. You are under ch bondage, you know, ch chain bondage, iron chain bondage. Somebody is going to cut to make you free, but he is 98% successful. Still then, you are going, ah, we are feeling pain. You are feeling pain now? Because still 2% there. That is Vishwana Chakotu was speaking. Always try to remember, don't forget. Patience is a great property in your life. Money is not your property. I can throw away money if I don't need for Guru Seva. If I need Guru Seva, I can accept. Don't forget this thing that your patience is the topmost property in your life. Even in Kirtan, Narottamuthakur writing, Prem Lave Dhajya Dhan. To get the property, Prem Dhan, you will have to bear all different kind of eventualities, different kind of problems, attack, everything. If you like to do Hari Bhajan, you should not have any complaint in your life. Whatever things happening, you should realize you should realize all happening by the desire of Bhagavan. Ashlishaba Badaratam Pinastumam Adarshanat Maramahatam Karutuba Jatha Tathaba Vidudhat Lampata Martanathastu Sha Eva Napara. Tomorrow I can discuss because Rati Yatra is a separation. I today I have no time to discuss this point. So, bonded soul anyway is feeling pain. Always try to remember, suppose you are totally free of bondage. Suppose you are totally free of bondage. You are dancing because you are free of bondage. But always remember, there is no reason for why you are dancing. Though you are free from maya, though you are free from anatta, still tomorrow you can again, tomorrow again, you can jump into maya. No surety. Only those who are hundred, hundred percent Guru Shevak, their life hundred percent dedicated for the service of Bhagavan. There is no problem. For them, no problem. Hundred percent dedicated for Guru Vishnu, whatever you find. All for Guru Shiva. Dedicated soul. And enjoying full keep of Guru Dev. No problem. But for others, there is problem. Even if you go out of Maya, someday you can again 
jump into Maya, no surety. That's why, that's why in Shastra it is written, Jivan Mukto Opi Punar Vandhanam Yanti Sakarma Vi. Jivan Mukto Opi, in living condition, he is free, totally free of, totally free of Anartha. So it is written in Shastra, Jivan Mukto Opi Punar Vandhanam Yanti Sakarma Vi. If your activities is wrong, then again you will be in the trap of Maya. Jivan Mukto Opi Punar Vandhanam Yanti Sakarma Vi. Be careful, always. Even in front of Bhagavan, even Bhagavan is there, you are with Bhagavan. Physical, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was there. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu manifested Lila, no? In front of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He is already there with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, still mm, he is in Maya. In Maya. He is with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu as a Sevak. Kala Krishna Das. He is going with Mahaprabhu. Always he is watching Mahaprabhu, what he is doing. Then, Kala Krishna is there with Bhagavan. Come on. But still after that, he is going to jump into Maya, Bhattathari, Woman Association. When? Mahapu is going to catch the hair and going to pull him back. Come on. So, even when Bhagavan is there, still Maya. Bhagavan is there. But still, how it is possible that Maya can catch them? Can we expect? I can speak about Balabhadra. You remember the name Balabhadra? When Mahaprabhu went to, went to Vrindavan, then Balabhadra was there all the way. Balabhadra was there. How it is possible that Balabhadra, now in confusion, about Siddhanta Vichar, about how possible? He is cooking for Mahaprabhu. Come on. He is cooking for Mahaprabhu. He is with Mahaprabhu serving. How possible Balabhadra can be in confusion? How possible? Many devotees coming from Vrindavan, Jamuna, I mean surround, surrounding area, and going to inform Mahaprabhu, going to pay Dandavat to Sanyasi, they don't know his Bhagavan. Oh, you are coming from Vrindavan. Ah, Prabhu, Krishna is visible. Krishna is visible in Jamuna. Oh, really? Mahaprabhu speaking. Really? Yes. Night time, Krishna visible in Jamuna. Kaliya Daman, Krishna dancing on the head of Kaliya. Mahaprabhu saying, oh, really? So? Yes. <laughs> Mahaprabhu Ma himself, Krishna. Oh, really? Ah, yes. Everybody, whatever people. You see Krishna there. Vrindavan, you are coming? Ah, yes. Everybody speaking night time, Krishna visible. Dancing on Kaliya. Many people coming to pay under, they are speaking the same message. Mahaprabhu asking them. After that, Balabhadra speak, requesting Mahaprabhu, Prabhu, I can also go. I can also go to see Krishna there in Vidna. I can all, if you permit me, I can go to see Krishna. Everybody is speaking Krishna, visible in Vrindavan. If you permit, I like to go there to see. After that, Mahaprabhu speaking heavily. You foolish, stop it. You can see Krishna there. Hey? In Kalikal, Krishna physically this way, Lila avatar, Krishna can come in the guise of human being. Bhagavan directly not coming this way. Like Chaitanya Mahaprabhu come in the guise of devotee. Lila avatar not doing. But everybody speaking, foolish, you sit here. After that, one very nice, intelligent people, educated people, Pandit coming to pay. Mahaprabhu asking, you see Krishna there in Vrindavan? Where Krishna? 
Mahaprabhu, everybody speaking, Krishna visible in Jamuna night time, Krishna dancing on the head of Kaliya. That intelligent man, I mean Pandit speaking, no, no. Actually, night time on fisherman with one light, you know, torch, you know, fire torch, uh, putting, yeah, going to, you know, catch fish with a net. And the boat is, you know, running. It seems that, you know, Kaliya, because boat is here. And the man is standing on the Kali, you know, boat, and the wave of Jamuna, this, they are thinking Krishna dancing. Oh, really, Mahaprabhu yes, Krishna is not visible there. Then Mahaprabhu speaking to Balabhadda, foolish, you see. You see, we like to go to see Krishna, but all they are right. They are all right because Saraswati is speaking all right. Everybody is speaking Krishna is visible in Vrindavan, but where visible they don't know. Really so, Saraswati is speaking right in their tongue. Really Krishna visible, but where Krishna is, they cannot detect the place where Krishna is. That is the main problem. Krishna is there in Akrur Ghat, Mahaprabhu, but they don't know. They are in confusion. So, even after we get free from trap of Maya, if there is a wrong activity, then again we can be in the trap of Maya. No guarantee. Only if I am going to, if I am going to enjoy full kipa of a very, very high elevated devotee. Full kipa. Full kipa means always is going to Guru Vaishnava going to protect me from Maya. My life, if my life is totally dedicated to a lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava, no problem. Then no problem. Only this is the problem. Popat many times used to say, Popat many times used to say, you see, Ajamil, Shaubhari Rishi, Yayati, you heard the name of Jayati? No? You heard the name of Jayati? I mean the son of Jayati is Jadu, and from Jadu, Jadu destiny started. Jadu Bamsa. So Jayati, Jayati, Shaubhari, Ajamil, you can find Pururava. Finally, they could get Mangal. But I cannot get Mangal. Why? Finally, Jajati, Shaubhari, Ajamil, they could attain Mangal because there was no complicacy in their heart. Their heart was Okay, they are in Maya, but their heart is not complicated. Their heart is not complicated. They, they wanted to get out of Maya, but what to do? Anyway. So, Papa told many times in his Harikatha, someday, Yayati, Shavari, Ajamil, Pururoba, they could attain Mangal. Because there was no complicacy. Their mind was very free mind, not septic mind. There were no septic Maya is there, okay, what to do? But there was no complicacy. That's why they But in if in our life, if you see I am Acharya, I am great devotee. Externally, everybody is speaking. But still, if there is complication inside my heart, compli complication mean? Complication mean? You would like to get love, puja, patishta, mani, position, everything. You would like to utilize Guru Vaishnava Bhagavan. That is called the most dangerous complication. That's why in Bhagavatam, one sloka, I already discussed many times before. Akamaha sarva kama va moksha kama udarudhi tibrena bhakti yogena purush jajeta purusham param. Many times I told you, you can remember. 
अकाम सर्व काम वा मोक्ष काम उदारदी तीव्रेण भक्ति योगेन जजेत पुरुषम परम अकाम नो कामना नो डिजय नथिंग सर्व काम फुल ऑफ डिजय ओके मोक्ष काम ऑल लाइक टू गो आउट all out of the range of pain i like to take himself out of the range of pain anyway if there is no complica no complication there if there is no complication or kama sarva kama va moksha kama udaruthi udar mane heart is open as complication there but there is no uh, purposely they are not going to purposely they are not going to play one trick purposely they are not going to play one trick to arrange la puja pratishtha enjoyment oh not that no nama parat nothing in that case some day you can get manga follow otherwise no question of any manga infinity period you can do bhajan no question of any manga so you can find ajamil was very nice man pururava was also very powerful man as man sobari was not bad man so how it was possible for them to jump into maya so it is really impossible save to save a bonded soul from maya next to impossible not impossible it is just next to impossible you don't know if you start hari bhajan specially those who are going to come out of their home specially for them those who are grihastha they are also but those who are going to enter into renounce order or men bamachari sanyasi for them great danger is really impossible always there in trouble always every time in bonded condition people their situation if you realize you can start crying like one fish like one fish taken out of water they become restless they like they like to enjoy their life hello just just one days before saturday one boy came he came himself getting all enjoyment nice prasadam nice place everything everything all harikatha he is himself coming after hearing hundreds but still feeling restless no problem nobody there nobody going to put in all the love but she cannot see. painful situation that's why pope are told is it is far it is far easy far more easy to make crores of hospital crores of educational inst institution but it is very dangerous to deliver a bonded self from maya really so whatever facility you give they don't like to do i was restless why they are coming out of home they don't know the reason if you ask all acharya they are all those who are doing why why you come out from, come out of home Pope was speaking. Pope was speaking. Maybe Pope was speaking. Maybe at the time of their leaving home. Pope was speaking. Maybe at the time of their leaving home, there was some realization. After hearing Hari Kata mixing with Guru Vishnu, they really could realize that uh, all temporary. And after that, they took decision to go. come out of home 
Papa speaking, they forget the purpose, they forget the purpose for which they left home. That is the main disease. They forget the purpose for why they left home. Now they are busy with La Puja Padishta. That's why Prabhupada is speaking. I left my home in search of Krishna. Prabhupada is speaking. I left my home in search of Krishna. But now, what happened? I am, I am in search of La Puja Padishta. I mean the idealism and the goal already changed. Follow. I know many such cases. I know many such cases. Even one Acharya at present, he told me. He personally told about his own experience. I am not going to speak his name. Billions of dollars collecting. He told personally, Maharaj, when I was at home, I was following Akadoshi, everything. Sometime I used to go to uh, Mayapur and used to go here and there to get Sadhu Sangha. That time my mood was very good. When I used to sit in my mud house, mud, his house was mud house. If you put one fist, when now billions of dollars. He forget everything about his past. He told about his own experience. He told, whenever I, whenever I used to sit in Harinam, then sometime used to, I used to feel something special. Sometimes tears rolling down my cheeks. But at present, after coming in mud, after serving Gurudev, everything, now I am not getting that feeling. He told personally. He personally told me. That time there was a nice feeling. Very nice feeling. Any amount of trouble I used to suffer that time after doing my daily duty of earning money, still I used to enjoy my bhajan. At least eight, ten hours I used to give for my service collecting money from here and there. He was the collector. But now, I am full-time, I am full-time devoted soul. But doing seva of Guru, Vaishnava, staying in temple, watching deity, hearing Harikatha, but that feeling I cannot get. I was thinking, how possible? How possible? That's why Papa told, when I left my home, when I left my home, that, that time my purpose was good. I left my home in search of Krishna. That was my only target. But now, at present, I'm acting as a charioteer. My target is separate. My mood changed. I left my home in search of Krishna. Now everything changed. I am in search of love, puja, patishtha, everything. How you can expect? How you can expect that you can come out successful in Hari Bhajan? How you can expect? Big problem. That's why Gokhishwar Babaji Maharaj used to say, when somebody used to, uh, somebody used to come to Gorkhishad Bhaji Maharaj to learn how to do Rupanuga Bhajan, Raganuga Bhajan. Gorkhishad Bhaji Maharaj is going to cheat him many times. He, ultimately he is going to lose his patience and speaking. Every day I am coming, you are speaking, no time, no time, you come tomorrow, tomorrow. He become angry and gone. Gaur Gisabhajima laughing. Gaur Gisabhajima laughing. They cannot bear, 
they cannot bear if ten rupees five one one paisa one paisa one if one if one paisa lost because the, on those days one paisa is very valuable one paisa so valuable one paisa i have seen in my life see i have seen one paisa coin one paisa two paisa three paisa i myself have seen father used to give and eh, two paisa ah go buy lajan lajan whiskey in my life i know two paisa and we are sitting in front of father give two paisa give two paisa i would like to go and take lemon juice <laughs> after so many requests yeah take go <laughs> and that two paisa eh even 5 rupees now one beggar don't like to take if you give 5 rupees they can throw to you you take 5 rupees what i can get by 5 are a beggar <laughs> one beggar in bombay one beggar going to throw the money to the <laughs> donor <laughs> well a foolish you are giving this money what i can i cannot get even one bread <laughs> this is the condition at present in bombay one beggar i give 10 rupees of 5 rupees coin and throw to the donor I speak eh huh? you are giving this donation i have dignity as a as a beggar beggar also have dignity na and they also like to protect their dignity this is the condition so uh this is the condition actually i know follow what i say uh, very dangerous situation in this situation hari bhajan is really at present hari bhajan is one kind of philosophy practically you cannot see dedicated so 100% at the time of prabhupad some dedicated soul was there at present also maybe but is rare very very rare very very rare mr vajan so to protect a bonded soul from maya and to engage in hari katha to protect a bonded soul from maya is one point second point to engage in maya because if you protect one bonded soul from maya and you are unable to engage in in hari vajan again you can fall down after getting mukti what we can do after getting mukti okay now i am mukta i am free from my but then what is your purpose what you like to do that is the main question na that is the main question so yatha yatha atma parimijyata sau mat punna gatha sabano vidhanai tatha tatha pasyati vastu suksham chakshu saiva anjana samprajuktam according to your hearing hari katha from perfect source you are making deliberate mistake how to hear hari katha you don't know i am trying i am trying i am trying every day every fraction of the whenever i talk with you i am speaking i am trying i am if you are trying countless time one time i can see you are successful but you are not successful because you are not trying you are speaking lie any time a chase devotee some devotee is speaking maharaj i am trying at least what trying countless time you are speaking same thing i am trying i am trying if you are trying at least the you, you are supposed to come out successful by now because countless time you are speaking same thing you are hearing hari katha at least and eh? after hearing so much rikat but because you have taken because you have taken resolution not to go out of maya you have taken resolution what i can do you have taken resolution not to go out of maya who can protect me i cannot go out of maya okay then what i can do if somebody going to take resolution who father can protect me i don't like to be protected Huh? Then I have no reason. 
Everything depends upon your Sankirtan, Harikatha Sankirtan. Even today is Gundicha Manyan, but Harinam Sankirtan is the predominating factor. I know today is Gundicha Manyan, so I am going to make background. For why, I, why I need to discuss Gundicha Manyan? What I can get benefit out of that? Have you seen? You have any practical experience? All Santo Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Bhumat Puri Goswami Mahadev Goswami Maharaj. You have seen? So how you can get, get realization? How you can get realization? You have no practical experience. Gundicha Manjan De, Bhakti Vita Mahadev Goswami, Bhakti Bhumat Puri Goswami Maharaj, Sri Santo Goswami Maharaj, all the big, big devotees, Bhakti Vala Pritya Goswami Maharaj, all they are doing Sankirtan all the way from the starting point from Mar and coming back to Sankirtan. You have no direct relation. Big problem. Day by day we are going to lose everything. Day by day we are going to lose everything. Who can protect us? So, according to your degree, according to the degree of your hearing Harikatha from right source, according to the degree, according to the degree, I mean percentage of your hearing Harikatha from right source, with full attention. Because Krishna is speaking, no? Yatha yatha atma parimijyate aso. Mahaprabhu told na cheta darpana marjana. First of all, Mahaprabhu teaching us. Your heart is very dirty. Try to clean it. How? Well, cheta darpana marjana. Bhava maha dabagni nirvapanam. Sriya kori vachandika vitaran vidyavudu jivanam. Anandan budivardhanam padipadam purunamitu asvadanam. Sarvatma Snabhanam Param Vijayata Sikhishna Sankirtana. We, everybody, we are reciting this sloka, but never we stop thinking about the inner meaning, what Mahaprabhu wanted to say. We never, we have no patience. That is the main problem. Upadeshamrita, one one sloka. If you go on discussing, you can open the direction. One one direction can be opened. One one direction can be opened. Oh, really? This sloka is a so deep meaning. We never, we never could realize so deep meaning. Only we say, "Bacho begam." Eh? Bacha Begam, Manasa, Krodha Begam, Mudarapasta Begam. Everybody decided. After that, what is the inner meaning? Nobody realized. All the secrecy of bhajan, there. All Sahaja Babaji's in Vrindavan, foolish there in Radhakun. They don't understand that Rupa Goswami wanted to indicate Shanyas Brata. By speaking this word, I mean the first loka of Upadeshamrit. They are thinking Upadeshamrit is the ABC Maharaj, is nothing. We are, we become gopi. Upadeshamrit is there, they are not going to discuss. In our sampradaya, also some group, ah, Upadeshamrit, yeah, I use this as a preliminary. Speaking like this much, this much adversity they have. This much adversity. I wonder. They cannot prove their body and mind pure. They cannot prove their body and mind pure. Even they cannot maintain their bed pure. But they are discussing whole day and night about Raghana Gopajan, Rupana Gopajan. Gopi Pram, everything. So rascal. They are not discussing. Bonded condition. Even cannot maintain the purity of their asana and they don't know how much purity you should attain. How much purity you should attain before 
going up to that level. First of all, do Harina. And Harinam you cannot do if Anatha is there. So in course of Harinam, Harikatha, you can go out of Then by the help of Harinam, actual Harinam, someday you can get everything. But they are not going to teach you that way. They are going to misguide you. Bacho Begam, Manasaha, Jiva Begam, eh, Krodh Begam, Jiva Begam, Udurapastha Begam. All Sala, Rupa Goswami wanted to indicate that before coming up to this level, you will have to get control over all your senses. Bacho Begam, Krodh Begam, Jiva Begam, Udurapastha Begam. Etano vegano jo bisho eta dhiraha sarvama pimam pithavim sashi shapt. Then you can have the right to speak harikatha, get control over others, not before that. Whereas those rascal going to destroy the whole world by misguiding the Sajya Babajis. They are going to criticize, ah, oh, Gaudiya Mat, they are giving sannyas, where from they get sannyas? Where from they get sannyas? Foolish number one. You don't know where from Goryamad getting sannyas? You are going to do Rupanuga Bhajan, rascal. You don't understand even the first look of Upadeshamrita. Uh, how much adversity you are going to, how how dare you going to pray, express this kind of mood? Huh? Foolish number one. This is the condition. Rupa Goswami already wanted to indicate, indicate that until and unless you are going to get control of your sense organ and sannyas mean tidanda, tidanda mean kai bakman, body by body, speech and mind. All different kind of activities we are doing, all sannyas. But they are putting question in front of Goryama, oh, where from you are getting sanya? You come to me. You and your father and grandfather, grand grandfather come to me. I can give answer to you. Where from Goryama are getting sanya? Rascal. Where from you get coping? Who cheater give you? Coping? White bears? Come to me. Speak to me. You are putting question. There is a condition. So, is very important. Mahaprabhu wanted to teach us, first teaching, the very first teaching of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. What is the teaching? Chaitanya Dharpana Marjanam, Bhava Mahadavagni Nabhaparam, Sreya Kaviru Vachandika Vidharanam, Vidyavadur Jivanam, Anandan Budivardhanam, Padivadam Purnamitu Aswadhanam, Sarvatma Snapanam, Param Vijayata Sikhista Sankirtanam. So in Gundicha Manjan is also Sankirtan. Jiva Goswami writing, writing in Sandarbha, though you need to perform different four, different kind of bhakti, all other bhakti mode, all different bhakti modes, there are six, 64 different kind of, but all should be together with Nam Sankirtan. Don't forget, all 64 different kinds of bhajan mode, 64 folds different, 64 folds of bhajan. But still, whatever bhajan you are doing, seva, all should be done together with Nam Sankirtan. Sankirtan, Sankirtan and Naiva Kriyeta, Jaddapi, Different kind, different folds of bhakti I need to, you know, follow, but still, Shankitan and Naiva Kriyeta, all together with Shankitan. That's when, in your life, if you are cooking, you have to do Shankitan. If you are working, you do Shankitan. You are washing your clothes, taking bath, Shankitan. All the time, Shankitan. Mahaprabhu told, Nam Nam Akari Bahuda Nijo Sarva Sakti Stattar Pita Niyamita Smaranena Kala 
etaddishi tava kiva bhagavan mamapi duddhaiva medisham mihajani nanu ragaha. Mahaprabhu speaking, in Harinam Sankirtan there is no hard and fast rules and regulations. We are not going to put attribute some rules and regulations. Oh, if this condition, no, any condition. While taking bath, Mahaprabhu told in Bengali, ki sha, ki bhajane, ki shayane, kim bajagarane, ki shayane when you sleep, ki bhajane, kim bajagarane, ahar nisha chinta Krishna balaha badane. Eh? Mahaprabhu teaching na. Mahaprabhu teaching in Kirtan you can find. In Bhajan Rasa also Bhakti Matagur quote. Ki shayane ki bhajane. Ki shayane ki shayane ki bhajane. Kim bhajagarane. Ahar nisha chintu kishna balaha badane. Whole day and night, a fraction of second, you should take shelter of that Sankirtan. Yagya Sankirtan. Harinam Sankirtan. Without which all failure. That day I was speaking, whatever Siddhanta you like to speak, whatever writing you are going to put in front of us, all should be approved by Sarup Gusai. Tomorrow I can discuss this point. All should be approved by Sarup Gusai without the, without the test certificate, without getting the test certificate. Without getting the test certificate from Sarv Gosai, my Harikatha has no value. My writing, my advice, no value. Don't forget. Without getting approval, without getting certificate of Sarv Gosai, my Harikatha, my writing, my advice no, has got no value. Don't forget. Because Sarv Gosai is the sole authority. Absolute authority. Who make him authority? Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is going to make him. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself, Supreme Lord, he is going to make him authority, the, the sole authority. Now, Gundicha Manjan Min, I already discussing. Gundicha Manjan Lila was expressed by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Raja Patabruddha was was very sorry. Why? 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 Why Mahaprabhu going to take the responsibility of cleaning temple? It is the service of one sweeper. They can do. Oh, all common devotees, they can clean. Oh my God, he's going to take this. It's not here. How I can love him? Ma Raja Patapuru has gone mad after hearing. Oh, Prabhu like to do this seva. How possible? But a Prabhu like to do this seva, so I have no right to speak. Prabhu like to do this seva. Who am I to forbid him? I have no right now. Prabhu himself like to. So ultimately, Patabhudu speaking, this is one kind of pastime, this is one kind of special leela Prabhu like to do. What we can do? Okay. And giving order to the servant, I mean the Serviceman, you go and always watch and try to realize whatever thing Prabhu need, you inform me, I can give everything. Then, after realizing the heart of Mahaprabhu, Parisha Patra means the servant, appointed by Raja Pratabhrudhu. He was appointed to check up what they need. I am going to inform, we need hundreds of boom to clean. Bucket, everything we need to clean, you know, pitcher, mud, mud, mud pitcher. Hundreds of pitchers, hundreds of, you know, we need. And then I am going to collect everything and then to collect everything. After that, in the very early in the morning, very early in the morning, Mahaprabhu, get ready. With all devotees doing Sankirtan, 
Prabhu going to give Mal Chandan, Chandan, in the head of all devotees and giving garland himself. And with enthusiastic mood, 100% enthusiastic, all chanting and singing, Mahaprabhu dancing all the way. You can walk, you can walk from Gambira up to, usually we are walking. But people taking Toto, Auto, they cannot walk. They are so lazy, they cannot walk. So Mahaprabhu, with full troops, are going to approach towards, towards, Gambhi, uh, towards that Gundicha Mandir. And after reaching there, Mahaprabhu is going to teach everybody, and have to do service of Prabhu. Today we are going to clean our, Gambhi, our Gundicha Mandir. And tomorrow our Prabhu can come. Be careful. Prabhu cannot sit anywhere dirty. I already told you. If the heart is dirty, Guru Vaishnava Bhagavan cannot sit there. Now Mahaprabhu started giving advice to everybody with one one boon, giving in the hand, all cleaning. All cleaning. And Prabhu sometimes giving warning, hey! Try to clean properly. No, your cleaning is not good. This way, well, hey, your cleaning is very good. You can teach him. Mahaprabhu speaking. Hey, your cleaning is very good. You can teach him. He's not doing proper seva. Follow. After that, what happens? When the all cleaning is over, then Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu going to collect all you know, dust, then everybody together going to put their dust and Mahaprabhu alone. Heaps of dust. They all together doing, but they have they are <laughs> but Mahaprabhu alone doing. After that, Mahaprabhu going to throw all dust particles, all stone chip, everything outside. After that, Mahaprabhu going to very carefully watching where is dust particle, everything and collect everything. Sand particle or this, that, you know, are going to collect. When the temple is almost a dust, almost, dust must be there. Then Mahaprabhu giving order, we need water now. Oh, then everybody running towards, Ma, everybody running towards Narendra, not, uh, Indodumna Sarva, backside Nishinga Mandir, backside. Gundicha Mandir, backside Nishinga Mandir, all you will have to go. A uh, five minutes worth, many times. Many times. I am going all the time. There, very nice, all people. There, they are going to collect water. Hundreds of people are going to take wa water and coming in the Gundicha temple and giving to Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu also again, they are also cleaning. Mahaprabhu cleaning. All Mahaprabhu cleaning. With all in a, in a pot of water, Mahaprabhu taking and throwing up, throwing all up, ceiling, all going to wash, all stone, now stone ceiling. Mahaprabhu going to take water and throw up, up here and there. Going to wash everything. After that, Mahaprabhu, you know, doing this seva, everybody cleaning. All water going to make one new pond. Follow. In the meantime, when, when, when Mahaprabhu busy to clean, all devotees, they are busy to clean, and they are not very one important thing. None of them, hundreds of devotees, none of them speaking material talking. No. Only if you need one water pot, Hare Krishna. If you need one boon, Hare Krishna, this way, all the signal, they are not speaking anything, only by signal, Hare Krishna. They are not speaking anything, boon, water for this, that, not, only Hare Krishna. They are speaking. So they are cleaning. In the meantime, what happened, you know? One very nice Gauriya devotee is very plain hearted. Brahman. Very nice devotee. He 
suddenly took one pot of water coming in front of Mahaprabhu and putting all water onto the lake, on the lake of Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu became, what is this? What you are doing? Mahaprabhu became angry, expressing angry attitude because as a temple, in temple, in temple you are doing offense. In temple, you are going to put water in my leg. This is Jagannath temple. Mahaprabhu not speaking, I myself Jagannath. I, in front of Jagannath temple, you are washing my leg. You have a great offense. Mahaprabhu expressing angry Leela, purposely. And going to call Saru. You call Saru. Saru coming. What happens, Prabhu? You see, your Gauriya devotees doing this kind of, you know, activities, you know. In front of Jagannath temple, he is going to wash my leg. Where I can go? I can go to hell. Mahaprabhu speaking. In front of Jagannath temple, I know Jagannath, because Jagannath coming now, sitting here. After within Ratha Yatra, Mahaprabhu can come and sit there. So in front of Jagannath temple, he is going to wash my leg. You see, Sarup, your Gauriya is doing this kind of, you know, Sahajiya activities. Fajil. Then Mahaprabhu speaking, Tomar Gauriya Kare Atek Phaijati. Phaijati means Sahaji activities. Your Gauriya. So our Guru Bhargava is going to point out, the Mahaprabhu is going to point out Sarup Gosai, not to anybody. Mahaprabhu could call another person. Why Mahaprabhu is going to call Sarup Gosai? Point, point, you know, big point. Mahaprabhu could call Sivananda Sen. Mahaprabhu could call other devotees. Why Mahaprabhu calling Saurabh Gosai? Because Saurabh Gosai is the only authority. Mahaprabhu already wanted, Mahaprabhu wanted to give the full responsibility of Gauriya Sampradaya to Saurabh Gosai. It is a Siddhanta Vishaya. It is written, Krishna Dhatma Kaviraj Goswami writing, Sarup Gosai is the original source of all rasa, everything. All oh, Sarup Gosai is responsible for, yes, Sarup Gosai is the sole authority to get control over our whole Vaishnava Samaj, Gauriya Vaishnava Samaj. Whole Gauriya Vaishnava Samaj. Sarup Gosai is the sole authority. Mahaprabhu wanted to point out. So, this way, we know that even in Gamira Mandir, when somebody coming with writing or poets, you know, poetry, anything, it was the usual rule. Any writer coming with any writing should be approved by Sarv Gosai. It's a testimony. So, if my Harikatha is not approved by Sarv Gosai, if my writing is not approved by Sarugu, Sarugu I mean Prabhupada. Sarugu Sai approval means Prabhupada approval. Prabhupada approval means Bhakti Matagra approval. Then no use. So this way, when Sarugu Sai came to know that Gauriya devotee wanted to put water uh, uh, on the leg of Mahaprabhu, Sarugu Sai is going to catch the neck of that Gauriya. Hey, go outside! Go outside, Ma. Sarv is going to catch the neck of that devotee. Go outside. Prabhu become angry for you. Go outside. Then after that devotee again crying and crying, coming in front of Sarv Gosai and Mahaprabhu, I have done mistake. I have done mistake. Please excuse me. I have done mistake. This way. And one very interesting thing, yeah, how sweet punishment. One very interesting thing, Mahaprabhu always very heavy. But this time, Mahaprabhu is going to give sweet punishment. Like the, like the, like the sweet punishment given to uh, Raghunath Das Gosai by Nityananda Bo. Hey, you have to, I can give you punishment. He will have to arrange all uh, chira and card, everything, uh, milk, everything, sweet, for all devotees. This is your punishment. It's called sweet punishment. Nithyananda Babu, <laughs> I can give you punishment. Punishment means Nithyananda Babu can put 
a lotus, lotus feet on head. So it is punishment or kipa. Even Brahma cannot expect. Sankar cannot expect. But Mahaprabhu said, Nityananda, I can give you punishment. What punishment? You have to arrange you all, chida, card, milk, and everything, all fruits and all my devotees. Raghunathu was like, very happy by getting this kind of punishment. This kind of punishment I like to get forever. <laughs> so Mahaprabhu also speaking to all devotees. Hey, you are not cleaning properly. You are not cleaning properly. If I find that your cleaning is not good, I mean, after collecting all dust particles, if your amount is very small, I can give punishment to you. You'll have to arrange all nice cake and, you know, everything of Jagannath Prasadam for everybody. If your cleaning is not good, I mean, if your collecting dust is very small, then I can give punishment to him. What punishment? He will have to arrange all nice cake, pita, pana, all he has to arrange. Mahaprabhu is going to give punishment. You have to arrange. This is your punishment. Hundreds of people, you have money in your pocket, no money. How you can arrange? Anyway, it is your punishment. You have to. Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu used to say, this is my punishment to everybody. This way, Mahaprabhu, after cleaning dawn, it is written. It is written in Chaitanya Charitamrita. It is written in Chaitanya Charitamrita that after all cleaning done, all clean, cleaning done, everything, still after that, when all cleaning done, everything done, after that, Mahaprabhu is going to approach the altar of Jagannath Baladi Shubhadra, going to take his Bahirvas, you know, this this Bahirvas, this is called Bahirvas. One, you know, this is called Bahirvas. Mahaprabhu is going to take his Bahirvas and going to take water and clean, rubbing, rubbing the altar. Is there any marking of, you know, dust, all clean. After cleaning, Mahaprabhu watching the altar of Jagannath Bhavadhi Subhadra and now Mahaprabhu smiling sweetly because now Mahaprabhu very happy. Cleaning is properly done. In Chaitanya Charitamrita, Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami writing. Very nice thing. But you should remember, don't forget, those who are Rasik Bhakta, those who are Rasik Bhakta, Siddhanta Bhid, they are always thinking and laughing themselves alone. Not that at the time of Harikatha they are speaking, they are thinking all day. All the time they are thinking about the Leela and laughing themselves. It is written in Chaitanya Charitamrita, Krishna Kubira Goswami writing, after cleaning so much, now, Mahaprabhu become very happy. It is Krishna Kubira Goswami writing as if Krishna Kubira Goswami writing as if Mahaprabhu going to open his own heart and going to show how much clean it is. It is written. Nijer Nirmal Hidai Jano Bahire Melilo. It is written in Chaitanya. Krishna Kavita Goswami writing, Mahaprabhu now happy, smiling, and now cleaning his heart. Very nice. Now, Krishna Kavita Goswami writing, as if Mahaprabhu himself going to open his own heart, going to show the cleanness, how much clean it is. Krishna Kavita Goswami. Nijer Nirmal Hidai Jano Bahire Melilo. All his own clean heart, Mahaprabhu going to expose in front of us, in the name of Gundisha Mandir Mahanjan. Now it's up to you to learn something or not to learn something. It's up to you. If you have some minimum consciousness, you can try to clean. Bhagavad Mandir is Bhagavad Mandir. 
externally we used to clean our temple. All devotees, they are taking prasadam, we squeezy, we are going to clean everything. This is our seva. Going to clean bathroom, latrine, this is our seva. If I am going to express, you know, sinus, oh, how I can do? I am elevated devotee. Not that. Not that is not good. I used to do. I used to clean all latrine, bathroom, all clean nicely. Or prasadam places after prasadam over. So seva is the seva is the main thing. No seva, no serving temperament. If you memorize whole Ved, Vedanta, Upanishad, everything, Bhagavatam, no use. Seva is the main. If you like to leave everything and come and join one Vaishnava to serve Guru Vaishnava Bhagavan. Don't waste your time in family life anymore. Total, whole life gone. Whole life gone. We cannot give time. So everything depends upon your serving temperament. Don't forget this one. Many times Prabhupada used to say, Everything totally, everything, top to bottom, everything depends upon your serving mood. The more you grow your serving mood, serving mood, the more you can get realization. Only by memorizing some philosophy, some doctrine, no use. Realization, where from you can get realization? Srila Gorkishat Das Babaji Maharaj speaking. Srila Gorkishat Das Babaji Maharaj speaking. Well, they have money in their pocket. They can go to market and buy books to recite. Okay, let them do. But where, where from they can get realization? Where from they can get realization? Green banana they can get. Realization is totally reserved by Guru Vishnu. You can memorize. You have your money, you can go to market and buy. But use, but use, but you can get. Realization where you can get. Realization is not available in the market in a shop. Come on. Realization is not available in a market that you can go and buy 1 kg, 2 kg realization. Not there. Realization is totally reserved by pure Guru Vaishnava. You will have to approach. You will have to cry in front of Guru Vaishnava. No other way of it. Now also up to you what to do or not to do. All reserved by Guru Vaishnava. If you play one trick, you will be in trick yourself. Be careful. With Guru Vaishnava Bhagavan, never try to play any trick. Plain hearted, you can express your mouth, Maharaj, I am weak. I fall down, I have no I am very weak person. You save me, that's okay. And you are going to play trick. I am very intelligent than Gurudev, Vaishnava. Ah. Then you can go to hell forever. Be careful. So, by this Lila, Gundicha Manjan, Mahaprabhu wanted to teach us Cheta Darpana Marjana. Be careful. This is the thing. The more you can clean your, because in Kalikal, if you like to do some austerities, penances, you can purify a little, a little bit, but in Kalika especially, but you can offer, if you like to offer milk, milk is also punched with water. Milkman going to punch water. If you like to uh, offer flour, I have seen myself. One flower man, he get up in the morning, uh, 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock, not taking bath, nothing. Maybe his body is contaminated. Even without taking bath, I am practically speaking to you. Even without taking bath, he is going to carry the pot. Because night time you, before sleeping, is make a big you know, packet and taking a cycle and going to sell garland. If you don't believe me, you come and stand there morning time 6 o'clock. Rathayatta tomorrow you stand there, I can show. Oh, there is one dirty thing, even not washing the eyes. 
Yes. So how is possible that you can expect, Bhagavan can accept that garland? Sleeping in the bed, doing all rubbish, not clean body, coming and... So garland is not pure, flower not pure, fruits, some fruit man is going to take kindly. This and after selling food, <laughs> what you can do? Yes, you like to see practical like you are blind, you cannot see. They are, they are selling all uchista. Maybe they are hungry. Nobody there, they are taking one apple and eating. After that, taking one PD. How much apple you need? Has given it to you. All contaminated. This way, everything contaminated. Honey also contaminated. Honey also contaminated. Everything contaminated. So only the thing you can do is to take shelter of Nam Sankirti. That you can do. Only you can do. Nam Sankirtan, if you are doing under the guidance of Guru Vaishnava, from heart, that you can. That can save you. You are hearing Harikatha, you are Sankirtan, that can save you. And all related, like, you know, like, you know, going, because at present, so many questions coming. If some bonded soul going outside for Sankirtan, Hare Krishna, what, what benefit? They themselves in bonded condition. If they go to market, follow what I say. They don't know. That's why no benefit people getting. Why people not getting any benefit? So many temples, so many societies, so many money circulating all around, but no benefit, no ultimate outcome. I know your investment, but I like to see only your outcome. What is the net outcome? Net outcome? Zero. After speaking Harikatha, hearing Harikatha, doing, taking prasa, everything, if I am not going to draw my, if I am not going to increase my consciousness, prema, what is the use? No use. All external function, all band party, all musical instrument, oh, jai Jagannath, jai Jagannath. But Jagannath is not happy because I have no devotional mood. Why Jagannath used to stand in front of? Tomorrow I can discuss. Jagannath standing. Nobody can pull chariot. Jagannath said, now I would like to watch Sankirtan. They are doing Sankirtan. Ma. Jagannath laughing and watching Sankirtan. Don't like to go. Everybody pulling. Jagannath not going. I can discuss tomorrow this way. So, you must be very careful. Sankirtan and Sankirtan related thing. Like allowing people to hear Harikatha. It is a main seva. Because on those days there was no, no recorder. That's why we are missing the Harikatha Prabhupada. On those days there was no recorder. So we are missing. No camera. So we are missing the golden opportunity. We have no scope to hear Harikatha, direct voice of Prabhupada. Bhakti Mr. Chakur. But at least those who are going to take shelter of Bhakti Mr. Chakur Prabhupada, we can distribute their Harikatha among public. That is also a big benefit. Those who are going to speak in total, everything, what Bhakti Mr. Chakur Prabhupada, all Siddhant, at least we can try to distribute. Something is better than nothing. But we have no scope to collect. Because on those days, our Guru Bhargava, they used to write, few were speaking Harikatha. Part, 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 they are writing. But now this kind of power is not there. On those days, our Guru Bhargava used to sit with pen and diary. Whatever purpose with part, they are writing. But at present, we have the scope to allow people to hear Harikatha directly. Maybe, maybe thousands of people going, maybe one or two can give response. Or maybe not. But still, some piece of Harikatha, or even one word, Bhakti Mata was speaking, even one word is entering, they are going, taking ice cream or Coca-Cola, maybe. But if one word suddenly going, 
someday the reaction of that transcendental sound vibration must be there. Must be there, this life or next life. It is the conclusion of Shastra. So don't worry, Popa told. Popa told, don't worry. I know most of the people, they are going to ignore. But still, somebody can give response. We cannot expect that thousands of people can hear this kind of top Harikatha. Follow. If there is one naked dancing, you can get thousands of subscribers. But if there is actual Harikatha, you cannot get subscribers. But for that, we should not break down. With full enthusiastic mood, we must go on speaking Harikatha, Sankirtan, with this hope. What this hope? To satisfy Sankirtan Pita. That is our only target. I am not going to satisfy you. My target is to satisfy Sankirtan Pita, Gauranga Nithyananda. Sankirtan Ika Pitaru. Pitaru means Vindavanda I already told in Chaitanya Vago. Panakavadatu, Sankirtan Pitaru, all Gaur and Nithyananda both. Today I have no time to discuss anymore. So try to get the point. Any Harikatha, any Lila of Gauranga. Try to go deep into this philosophy. So the sloka is started. Tomorrow I can discuss. What is that? Sri Chaitanya Padambuja Madhupebhya Namo Namaha Kathanchit Asrayat Jesam Sha Opi Tat Gandhavag Bhavit. I can discuss this slok tomorrow. One Chakalpaturu Sikhipa Sindhu Bhavacha Patitanang Pavane Bho Vaishnav Bhyo Namo Namaha. So tomorrow is Ratha Yatra. We must be very careful. We can hear Harikatha, we can sing the glories of Bhagavan. So, try to realize all Harikatha. Not that hearing and going.